Hello everybody, welcome to my channel. My name is Amber. So I was shopping around Sephora and I saw this Hula Glow bronzer and it caught my eye because of the packaging. On the front it has the bamboo stalks wrapped around with some cute sparkling Christmas lights. And then around the sides as some more Christmas little decorations. But I don't want to get sucked into the cute, adorable packaging and buy it just for that. So I started kind of looking into it to seeing what it's all about. So this is a limited edition Sephora exclusive and it is a shimmer powder bronzer. So this is going to combine Hoola's cult favorite bronze shade with a super fine satin shimmer. So it's supposed to give you a radiant sheen glow, a lit from within look. What do you think? Do you think it's going to do that? So if you want to see if this does give your skin a beautiful glow and if it's worth the $44, then first make sure you're subscribed and hit that notification bell. And then sit on back, relax, have a laugh, and I hope you enjoy this video. All right, I am on my lunch, sitting in my car. It is a rainy, dreary day, and we got cars gunning it by. But I wanted to see if my bronzer, does it look lit from within? So I'm out here in the natural light. Again, it's a dull, dreary, mad day. And does my face look nice and cheery, nice and bright? What do you think? But this just has a very, very subtle sheen to it. So right now you probably can't even tell that it has it, but when I'm at work and the light is on my face and it just catches it just right, you can see a very subtle glow on my face. Uh, so not only do I have cars racing behind me, the guy a couple spots over just had to turn his radio on super loud. Does he not see that I'm taping a YouTube video here? So if you hear a radio, it's the guy over there. Anyway, so what I really enjoy about this bronzer is it does not have big chunks of glitter in it. So a lot of times when products claim that they have a wonderful sheen or a nice glow, yeah, it's got chunks of glitter in them and I love glitter. I'm the first to say that I love me some glitter, but I do not want it on my forehead. I don't want it all over my cheeks. I don't want it on my nose. No. Now let's talk about the pigment. So this bronzer, woo, it has some pigment. So today when I put it on, I put my brush in and then I tapped off the excess and then I wiped it on my hand to get a little more off and then I went into my face and I felt like that worked a lot better. It's always better to start with a little bit and you can always add more than to go straight on that face and put that big old streak on your face and then you're like, ah! and then you're trying to blend, 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 blend and my phone is starting to slip. <clears throat> okay, so blend, 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 blend and you're struggling to make it look good and not like a big old streak on your face. Now let's talk about the brush. So I really enjoyed using the brush. I thought it applied the product great. It was soft, but still firm enough where it didn't just blow all the powder around and barely put any color on. And it just applied it perfectly. But it's great if you wanna chisel out those cheeks or keep it nice and tight around the hairline. And then it's great for contouring the nose. So because the sheen is so subtle, can I really tell a big difference between this bronzer and my matte bronzer that I usually use? So here is the Bronze Goddess by Estee Lauder. And this is the bronzer that I use every day. And I'm gonna swatch this on my middle finger. Now I'm gonna move on to the Hula Glow and I'm gonna swatch this 
on my index finger. So you can sort of see that the ring finger has a slightly more glowy look than my middle finger. So my final thoughts on this bronzer is it's beautiful. It has a beautiful, barely there sheen, has great pigment, but is it worth buying it for $44? So it's a toss up. I think you're gonna be very happy with it. It's gonna look beautiful on you. It's gonna give you that nice subtle glow. But on the other hand, is it a must have? You need to run out there right now and spend your $44. It's up to you if you wanna try this product or not or give it out for a gift. Well, thank you for watching this video. And as always, have a blessed day. Remember Jesus loves you and we'll see you in the next video. Bye. So I just picked up the Hulo. <laughs> so I just picked up the Hulu. It's not Hulu. It's not Hulo. I just picked up the. I just picked up the Hula Glow.